I'm David Burke, I'm the Vice President of Science and Conservation here at Holden Forest and Gardens. And we're here at the Long Science Center in one of the research greenhouses that we use for some of our experimental work. I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit today about beech leaf disease. Beech leaf disease is an emerging pest that was first noticed in Lake County in 2012. And since 2012, it's kind of spread throughout Ohio and also into much of the Northeast. So places as far away as Connecticut, for example, have found beech leaf disease in some of their forests. The cause of beech leaf disease has been uncertain in 2018, we began doing work with the U.S. Forest Service and the USDA to try to identify the cause of beech leaf disease. And what we've found is that there's a nematode, a small microscopic animal similar to a worm, that came from Asia uh, and is infecting the, the trees within our area and causing beech leaf disease. These nematodes can infect the buds of beech trees. It's a little early in spring, so these beech trees have not quite let out, but you can see the leaves beginning to leaf out here. But these nematodes will infect the dormant buds and overwinter, and then as these leaves begin to open up in the spring, they already have the nematodes inside them, and evidence of beech leaf disease. Beech leaf disease basically is characterized by some dark intervenal banding that you'll see in the leaves. So it looks like you've got these dark bands between the, the veins. And uh, in addition, over time, the leaves can begin to set, senesce and curl and die, causing damage to the beech trees. So we've been working on this since 2018, and we continue to do some work in this area, helping to monitor the spread of this nematode in Ohio, as well as trying to investigate control mechanisms, such as pesticide application, for example, which could help to control this nematode on landscape specimens in your home and in your gardens.